Hello and welcome to another video from My Random Hobbies and today we're talking about Hot Wheels cars but Hot Wheels cars that have a dual purpose so they're not just for racing on the track they've been made with something else specifically in mind. So let's get started. So there are a number of cars um, that Hot Wheels have made that have a dual purpose, that, that there is an ulterior uh, motive for their sort of design, if you like. Now, there are five, uh, yeah, five that I'm going to talk about today. One of them, I think the sort of effect is a bit dubious, but the others are quite, quite clever, quite fun, quite novel. Um, so let's let's look at the first one, which I think is probably the the least my least sort of favourite, and this is called the Night Burner. Um, nothing particularly special, I don't think, about the design. Now I'm not sure if this is supposed to actually whistle, but there is a hole in the back that you blow into, and it it spins air in this turbine bit here and it, it just makes a kind of rattling sound now whether i've got a defective one or not i don't know but if i blow into it just kind of makes a rattling sound so i'm, I'm not entirely sure whether i've just got a defective one or whether that's the, all they do probably the weakest one for for me for sort of cars that do something else but that's the night burner um then the second one uh, which I actually think is quite a novel and nice thing to probably carry around in your pocket, um, is this. It's called Fast Cash. And you can see there, it's just a relatively low, small car with this sort of clip on the back. And that's for sliding your banknotes in. Um, it's a money clip, basically. So you can carry this around in your pocket a bit of a play with your Hot Wheels car um, and keep your money, your notes safe, uh, supposedly, in your pocket. Um, now it does have sort of armoured doors on the side there. Uh, I'm just trying to, I've got I made a few notes as well on this. Uh, there's a dollar sign on the engine, um, which you can just about pick out, hopefully on the front there i don't know whether it's going to focus enough what again i'll do is i'll post some pictures of these on there but it, there's the dollar sign just about you can see it just about um and then a combination lock on the rear uh so again it, it's just it's a little bit different uh but that's a money clip there then we have teed off t double e um, it's a stylized golf buggy basically and it has on the sort of exhaust engine bit here a little dimple that just so happens to fit a golf ball and you can tee off from this car so it, again a novel golf tee really but I, I quite like that idea uh, and I quite like the idea of actually taking it on the golf course and smashing a couple of balls off there a uh, bit novel, bit different. So I like that one. So that's teed off. Then we come to another one that's potentially got good sort of um, use, and this is the Tooligan. So again, you can see that the sort of real rear spoiler, if you like, on here is a spanner. That's a three eighths inch uh, spanner or wrench, depending on where you are in the world. Um, and then on the bottom here, you've got a hex. Um, bolt thing as well so you can do hex bolts up uh, and undo them with the bottom of the car um, there's also in theory apparently um, the ability to attach in that hex bolt bit um, your Phillips screwdrivers and, and things like that so you, you often get attachments um, on your electric drills and things so if you stick those in there then you can turn this into a flat or a Phillips screwdriver. So Tooligan, potentially quite useful. Uh, but again, it, it's a toy car, but it's a bit of fun. Uh, and the final one, which I actually have one by my um, chair in, in the living room um, for when I'm having a beer or something, is this one. This is the Carbonator. 
And as you can see, it's got a bottle opener on the rear end. So the spoiler is a bottle opener and the actual body itself looks like a bottle. It's designed to look like a carbonated bottle. And also, I believe, I don't know if you, it's going to focus on there, you can see a sort of like ring pull image here. Uh, and that little bit on the front is to get underneath your ring pull so that you can, uh, you're not breaking your fingernails off um, when you're trying to open a can. So it's got a bottle opener. It's got a can opener if you like for the little ring pull cans um, and again just a fun little thing they, they do them in lots of different designs they keep bringing them out there every now and again uh, in different colors etc uh, they do the carbonator in um, for new year so there are new year editions for these as well um, so something fun to perhaps collect something a bit different but hot wheels cars that have a different purpose um, there are a couple of other things out there, uh, variations on, on these five, uh, but though they're the main five that you'll find. So I hope you've enjoyed that, a slightly different um, thing to look at today. Um, and we'll be back again soon for another video from my random hobbies. Please like, please subscribe, it does help. It helps, if nothing else, it cheers me up. Uh, comment. Uh, I'll try to comment back on pretty much all comments that are made um, and I'll see you again very, very soon. Take care for now. Bye-bye.